What's up, y'all? So we are back with episode two of the Meteor Mission of Super Dragon Ball Heroes. And I'm so excited to get into this with you guys because the first episode was pretty good. And uh, we're now here with episode two. Looking like we're getting some Dragon Ball GT stuff going on here. I'm really excited for us to dive in. Thanks again, before we play this, thanks again to Super Chronicles here. Uh, here on Twitter for getting us this... Uh, well, he didn't get it to us, but he posted it here. Um, and it's looking like Super Saiyan 4, Limit Breaker, Goku, Zeno, and Vegeta versus uh, Baby Cell, Frieza, and Ozoto. Oh, Ultra Instinct, Goku, Blue Evolution, Vegeta at the at the Zeno at Planet Namek. Oh, wow. Okay. Very nice. Well, without any further ado, let's dive in here. Let me make sure all the sounds on. There we go. All right. Super Dragon Ball Heroes. <laughs> The god hunting battle continues. Two intertwined battles. Just why in the hell did you make us look like we were running away? I'm really impressed by the CGI this in this second episode. In the first episode, the CGI looked very miffed. Here it looks pretty good. So who was that supreme guy of time? I like I like all of this so far. It looks a lot better than the first episode. Gained so much power. Absorbing them, he has also gained each of their abilities. Oh, how interesting. Um, you know, you never really hear Vegeta say Piccolo's name very often. He recover and go as quickly as possible so we can go after Ozo. Oh, look at this. Whoa. What is happening here? Why is why is Supreme Kai and Kabito walking with him? What the? What is happening? Are my transformed bodies split up from me? What? It was truly delicious as expected. Dude, what is going on? Transformed into into several figures. Wow, that's kind of creepy. Also, that my power can grow. Oh, he turned into a baby. Interesting. He didn't even know who he was going to turn into. How interesting is that? Oh, Xeno Goku and Xeno Vegeta. Here we go. From a different dimension. Even he's able to recognize that. How interesting. Spending on beating them to a pulp, but they ran away. There's something different about him. Oh, he's gonna eat them. Is this full power? We're about to see. Yep, full power Super Saiyan 4. I find the red hair to be interesting. Gotten a little stronger this time, he says. Oh! Wow, okay. The animation here is, is be again, better than the first episode. A lot better. But it's still not great. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, back into his re regular form. Being who devours everything and obtain all powers as a result. One day the entire universe shall even fill my stomach. Oh, that's kind of weird. It's kind of creepy. Oh. 
Interesting. Oh, Frieza and Cell. <laughs> Did he run? Did he run? Oh, no. Dude, it's so cool to see Cell. Interesting. But dude, they should be able to just blast right through him. It's Frieza and Cell. Unless Ozoto gave them a power boost. Now, wow, they killed all the Namekians. Oh, they've been all absorbed. Wow. Including Dende, huh? Wow, he's here on Namek, too. That's weird. He's on the Supreme Kai planet and on Namek. Entire life force of this planet. Wow. He's absorbing everyone. No wonder he's so strong. It won't be like last time. Yeah, they're ready for him this time. Oh, going straight to Ultra Instinct. Wow. Dude, they're going all out from the start. He's Blue Evolved. Let me turn this down a little bit. Oh, dude. Oh, he felt them. He felt them over there. Wow. Yeah, dude. Look how quick that was. He didn't even have time. Interrupt for a moment. Uh oh, what's he gonna say? Return, I shall call them back in. I invite you two to my palace, the Ozoto Palace. Oh, interesting. Oh, he's telling them too. Unleash my true power, just like I said. But it's not his real strength. Is he trying to play to the Saiyan's weakness of uh, wanting to fight them at their full strength? Wouldn't you like to save your friends? So you're interested in it, it seems. Yeah. guide you to the Azoto Palace. Oh, is that an invitation? How weird. Oh, and that's it, huh? Wow, look at that. Dude, how cool. It kind of ended with him kind of giving them like an invite to like the palace. That's kind of that's kind of cool. I mean, I'm not like super in love with this uh, with with Super Dragon Ball Heroes. I'm, I never really have been. It's just kind of just like a fun thing to just kind of watch. Um, but I thought I, I I really liked this episode as opposed to the last one. Last episode we saw was the animation was really bad. Um, a lot of it just didn't work. Um, wasn't a big fan of it. The you know mostly the animation, but this one it was a lot better. It wasn't perfect, but it was a lot better than the other one. But uh, anyways, y'all, uh, what did you guys think of this episode? Leave your comments down below in the comment uh, uh, in the comments down below. And as always, I will catch you guys in the next video. Bye.